New Honda Jazz Sport 2018 Review The Honda Jazz has a new range topping sport trim, complete with styling tweaks and extra power. Verdict 3. There's a certain endearing quality to the Jazz Sport, with its willing and rev-hungry pedal engine on top of the sporty new look. However, there's no doubt that it all comes at a relatively high price. For us, it makes more sense to buy one of the cheaper versions, all of which still have the qualities that appeal most to the Jazz's target market, its space and practicality. As tales of the unexpected go, this is up there with anything that Roald Dahl could have conjured up. Probably the last word anyone would associate with the Honda Jazz was sport. Yet, here we are, in a car that boldly combines those exact words. The Sport is the new model at the top of the revised Jazz range, which was first seen at last year's Frankfurt Motor Show. Like the rest of the lineup, the Sport has adopted a new look that's designed to make the company's smallest car fit in with the rest of its range, but then it gives it all a further sporty twist. Best Super Minis You Can Buy Honda's first step was to attend to the front grille and headlights, which now have more than a hint of the Civic about them, and, the bumper is more sharply sculpted around the air vents. The Sport also makes some attempt to ape the Civic Type R, with a thinner front splitter below the grille, and red detailing on the bumpers. It also gets black alloy wheels, side skirts and a rear spoiler, while the headlights are posh full LED units. Inside, meanwhile, the seat upholstery has a pinstripe pattern, there's leather trim on the steering wheel and gear lever, and the finishing touch is orange stitching throughout. This is no mere cosmetic revamp, however. While the rest of the range continues with the familiar 101 BHP 1.3 liter pedal engine, this new flagship jazz comes with a 128 BHP 1.5 liter unit. What that all amounts to is a list price of £17,155, making the sport the most expensive version of the jazz, which is already one of the more expensive super minis in this class. So, what do you get for your money? Well, what you certainly do not get is a hot hatch. At a time when the engines in the Volkswagen Polo GTI and forthcoming Ford Fiesta ST are knocking out the best part of 200 bhp, the 128 bhp output of the Jazz Sport looks distinctly modest. Instead, it's best to think of it as just a relatively warm hatch that rivals the likes of the Fiesta ST line, Polo R line and C to Visa Father what the Sport lacks in outright performance, the engine makes up for with a willingness to rev, and, although peak torque only arrives at a lofty 4600 revolutions per minute, there's just enough pull at low revs to ensure you're not embarrassed when the lights turn from red to green. The Jazz can entertain on the right roads, then, but there are more complete warm super minis that are more engaging to drive. Drive. Yes, the Jazz handles securely and doesn't roll too much when you corner enthusiastically, but it doesn't have the blend of comfort and agility of, say, a Fiesta or a Visa, and the steering that's quick and easy around town feels rather lifeless when you're pushing harder. At least you don't lose what is most appealing about the Jazz in the sport, its space and practicality. This is a surprisingly big small car, with more space inside than many cars from the class above, you could happily carry four adults inside, and even five at a push. Excellent visibility also makes it easy to park and place in town. However, all of this is also available in cheaper version of the Jazz, and we can't help thinking that they will make rather more sense for more people than the Sport. P Specs Price, £17,155 Engine, 1.5 liter 4 sil petrol. Power slash torque, 128 bhp slash 155 newton meters. Transmission, 6 speed manual, front wheel drive. 0 to 62 miles per hour, 8.7 seconds. Top speed, 118 miles per hour. Fuel economy, CO2, 47.9 miles per gallon, 133 grams slash km. On sale, now.